Hello and welcome to a video demonstration of the Friado HD series of Delhi hotcases. What we have here is the HD5, which is a five well hotcase. Comes standard on legs for counter mount. It also has a stainless steel base with a stainless steel front and rear panel. The stainless steel panel can be removed and you can have an open pedestal, uh, European pedestal type design. There's the panel up on the other side as well. So as you can see, it's a standard curved glass uh, front unit with very clean lines. One of the things you'll notice is the side of the unit, there isn't a rail bumper system, so you can mount two systems together, and it looks as if it was one case. The uh, side is just exactly uh, flat all the way down. It comes with uh, oh, a front uh, bumper for a cart bumper and it does come with a pan set. Uh, they will take a full size and a one-third size pan so you get five full size, five thirds and the dividers. Front glass as with most cases opens up and out of the way. One of the unique features about the Friado case is that the uh, pilasters, the shock absorbers, are actually contained within this side uh, bar and not out in the open to catch dirt and those type of things. I think I can get pretty close in there that the pilasters on either side are uh, right there. So now we have the open case design. This case is also available in a self-serve design, which would have a glass up about six inches in the front, and then a shortened uh, top glass that would come down to leave a wide area for the customers to go in. Again, the uh, side uh, glass is easily removable. It just slides out for cleaning, and slides back in, and just rests in there very easily so that they can be uh, cleaned. See if you can get it back in there. Perfect. Not quite. All the way in. There we go. Good old demo. Perfect. Uh, the pans, show a little bit. Now the pans come out. And the inside of the bottom of the case has a radius corners for ease of cleaning. It's a smooth stainless steel opening. And then we have a one of the air returns underneath. This is a convected air case. These um, air along the back and then across the entire front of the case, which we get a front to back airflow, uh, gentle airflow over the products. Again, this is a five foot well unit, but you can also put granite or anything else you'd like in there. This is a glass, a black glass, but it can be any color, of course that uh, goes in to put bowls or uh, bread products or sandwiches or something on top of that. Underneath the center pan is our humidity system and this is the pan where the water sits for the case humidity. On the sides, uh, the pans can be six inches deep. In this center pan, uh, only a four inch deep pan because we have that humidification system underneath. There's a stainless steel Shroud across the top that covers up our lighting, uh, super bright lights uh, shining down on the product, as well as over each product well a ceramic infrared heater that uh, we'll talk about in a minute to uh, help adjust uh, for the crispy foods versus the uh, soft foods that you want to keep a lot of high humidity on. And of course the mirrored glass standard rear doors. So we'll drop that back down and give you one more look at the front of this case. Beautiful presentation. And here we are on the operator's side of the Friado Hot Deli case. We have our Easy Glide opening doors, which allows a very wide access area to the product. Part of the reason for that is we don't have any controls or complicated wiring and anything up across the top of the case. It's a very thin area, just a small fan to keep 
the wiring and stuff we do have up there. It allows a very wide opening uh, to the product inside the case. We also do things differently on the hot, or excuse me, the cutting board side of things. Our cutting boards are not a full length cutting board. They are individual cutting boards that come off. This cutting board can now go to the three compartment sink or right in the dishwasher for cleaning. A couple of very easy to locate uh, tabs. You can put one, two, three cutting boards across the top. You can also mount tom holders, uh, bag stands, or whatever else you uh, uh, traditionally mount on the back of your hot case. This is a humidified case. We do add water to this case. Here's where we do it. Um, it's a manual fill. Just put a gallon of water in in the morning. On a busy day, maybe another half a gallon to a gallon in the afternoon. There is a low water sensing device that gives us both an audible and visual alarm should the case require some additional liquid to provide the humidity. A very clean back. Here's where the uh, power connections are. They can come up through the bottom as well. And uh, single or three phase operation. The best feature, one of the best features of this case is the control panel. It's a flush mount control panel. There are no knobs to be knocked off by carts or employee knees. It's got a super large temperature display. Very easy to set the temperature during the day, up or down. To the right of that is where we set our humidity controls. One third, two thirds, or full humidity. You can see our low water sensing light is flashing. Then across the top, these are the switches where we toggle on and off the individual pan over radiant heaters. Those are the ceramic heaters above each pan that allow us to regulate the surface humidity on the products. For instance, if we were to have in our two right-hand pans fried chicken and we want that to remain crispy, then we just toggle these two on and the other three pans will just have the convected high humidity airflow across them. This is how Friato handles individual pan or individual zone humidity and it is a superior and very simple way to do this. As you move products around you can toggle on and off the overheat. So there you have it. The Friato MD series Delhi Display Hotcases.